Hey you guys! Today I'm going to be showing you how to change your iCloud email and password. I'm going to be showing you how to do this on your iPhone as well as on a MacBook, so have one or both of these devices on hand so you can follow along as we go through. Let's jump right in. So first, let's go over how to change your Apple ID password. So first off, you're going to want to launch your settings. And up at the very top, you'll want to go in to your Apple ID. This is just going to be where your initials are or your name. And then we're going to go into sign in and security. So this is going to bring you to all of your sign in information and details. And we're going to click on that blue change password option. So when you click on this, you're going to be asked to enter in your current passcode. And now you're just going to be prompted to type in your new password. So you'll Type it in in the first box here, and then you're just going to verify it by retyping in the exact same password below. And then once you're finished, you'll just click that change in the top right corner. Hey, if you're finding this video helpful, you can also support the channel through Super Stickers. Super Stickers basically just help fund the channel, and it helps us continue to create content for you guys. Thanks, and let's get back to the video. Next, let's go over how to change your email in your Apple ID. You're gonna follow the same steps as before. So we're gonna launch our settings. We'll go into that Apple ID, back into sign in and security. Except this time, we're gonna go up to the top into that email and phone numbers option. And to the right of this, you'll find that edit icon. So we're gonna click edit. And next to your email or emails, if you have multiple, there's going to be a, a red icon with a line through it. This is the delete or remove option. So when you click this, a delete option is going to open up on the right hand side. You're just going to click that and it's going to confirm whether you want to remove this email address or not. If you do, you'll click remove. Once that email address is removed, you will want to add a new one. So you'll go back into that edit option on the right. And then you'll just simply add an email or phone number and then you'll select an email address. And then you're simply just gonna follow the prompts on the screen by entering the email address. What's gonna happen after you enter it is a verification code's going to be sent to that email address. You're going to have to sign in on whatever platform um, you use, and then simply type in that verification code, then your email address should be added. Super simple, now let's jump over to the MacBook and I'm gonna show you guys how to do the same thing. Okay, now that we're on the MacBook, let's go over the same steps. So first and foremost, let's go over how to change your Apple ID password. The first thing you're going to do is go up to the top left corner of your screen and you're going to select that Apple logo. And then a drop down menu is going to pop up and we want to go to system settings. Once here, we'll go back up to the top and we'll go into that Apple ID. And then we'll go back into sign in and security. To change our password, we're going to go down to this change password option here. We'll click this and first we'll be prompted to enter in our email password just to just to confirm that it's us. When I click this, it's just going to ask me to enter my password to allow changes to be made to my Apple ID. Once that old password has been entered, I'm just going to follow the prompts once again um, and enter my new password followed by the verification of that new password. And then I'm just going to click that change in the bottom right. Okay, and now on to changing your email in your Apple ID. So to change your email address, you're actually not going to follow these steps as for some reason Apple um, on the MacBook doesn't allow you to change your email um, in your system settings. However, there is a way to do it. You're just simply going to open up your browser and you'll want to go to appleid.apple.com. This is going to bring you to a sign in page where you are in fact going to sign in. You'll have to sign in with a verification code that you'll receive most likely on another device that you have. You're gonna go back in to email and phone numbers. And then beneath that one email address here, we'll find that remove button to the right here where you'll click it and be prompted to enter in your new Apple ID, which is just going to be whichever email that you want. Once you have that typed in, you'll change the Apple ID what you'll have to do is follow the prompts once again basically just sign into that email that you just entered and and then enter the verification code that you get sent once that verification code has been entered your apple id should successfully have been changed Alrighty, you guys that's it for today's video i hope that you found this helpful maybe you can use this information or maybe you can pass it on to somebody else who needs it thanks again and as always i will see you guys in the next video